Tony, and this is my review for the V11 Dyson uh, from Good Guys. Normally you'd find me vacuuming uh, with my headphones on listening to podcasts. So this Dyson V11, being a lot quieter, is a lot better for listening while I'm vacuuming. The great thing about this is they have a plastic tense transparent tool bracket that sits on there so you can carry the most used tools around on the stick wherever you go. You get the smaller version of the power head, you get the upholstery one, you get the brush, you get the crevice and you also get the mount if you wanted to put it on your wall. The great thing about this being battery operated with no cords is you can just keep going across the carpet and then once you go from the carpet straight onto the hard tiles, no pushing of buttons, everything just automatically switches across. You have three modes, economy mode, auto mode and a boost mode. Found that I haven't had to use the boost mode. Um, on the economy, on the auto mode, it'll switch between your hard floors and your soft floors. So it makes it very easy to use without having to flick any manual switches. The only downside I can see after using this for a few weeks is you have to keep your finger on the trigger the whole time. There's no actual switch to turn on and off. So you constantly have to hold your, your finger on that trigger. But the great thing is it's so light, it's so convenient. The ball swivel on the end it just makes it so much easier to get into hard corners and we'll give you a quick sample. As you can see, you just got one hand of juice straight off up onto the stab and then you just straight onto the hard surface, no touching of switches. You just straight on the hard surface, it automatically picks up hard surface, carpet, and adjusts the uh, battery and the, the volume and the power automatically. The convenience of this Dyson V11, obviously, is it's cordless. And in a house that we have that's long, it's uh, constantly pulling out plugs, um, moving to the next spot, plugging in again. Whereas this thing, I can do the vacuuming a lot quicker with not having to change the box, everything is all just packed in very neat. I'm surprised how much stuff was put into such a small box. Um, the other good thing about not only being cordless and being light is the way that the ease of emptying it. It's a matter of just pushing button there, pushing that trigger forward, which opens the door and you just tip it out into your bin. Very simple to use, very easy, one-handed. I'm very impressed. All in all, it's the, the best things about this is it's easy to empty, it's lightweight, has a good battery life, and it's uh, cordless and a lot quieter. Makes my podcasts while I'm vacuuming and doing the house chores a lot more enjoyable.